year. I've been so glad to see anyone in my whole life. Yeah. Is it over? How'd it go? Watching my daughter say goodbye to her baby. I don't ever want to do that again. How's she doing? I think she's all right. She's upstairs with Brody. Yeah. How you doing? I don't know. I feel... I feel responsible. But how are you responsible? My daughter's husband dies. And I went to Africa for a month. No, Vicky, I'm not going to let you do this. Do what? No, look, I spent my whole life blaming myself for every bad thing that ever happened to Jared. And I used that as a reason to get drunk and to stay drunk. And all I know is that I wasn't any good to him that way. Look what happened. It's sad. It's so sad. But you can't blame yourself. It's not your fault. You did not kill your baby. There's not any part of you that could do that. She died of RH disease. Because Nash and I weren't the same blood type. And if I had have gone to the doctor's appointments, then she would be okay. You she would be alive right now. Don't yes, I do. I do know that, Brody. I knew that the night that she was born. Why do you think I stole Star's baby? Because you were in pain. No, I wasn't in pain. I didn't feel any pain. I didn't feel any guilt. I made sure I didn't. You're feeling it now, though, aren't you? You're in a whole world of pain. Not this. Not Tess. You. So? So you're handling it. If you call this handling it. It doesn't have to be pretty. The only way past it is to get through it. I don't think I can do this. Yes, you can. And I'm going to be with you every step of the way. I don't want to see you marry Clint to avoid your feelings for Bo. Listen, our son was in an accident. It was only natural for us to get a little closer. Closer is one thing. Almost make out? That's okay, a whole different deal. We didn't deal. almost make... Now stop it. That didn't happen. Okay? Sweetheart, Bo and I were divorced for very good reasons. Okay? I love Clint. I, we have something wonderful, and I don't want to throw that all away on an almost moment with my ex. And why are you dragging your feet announcing your engagement? I'm not dragging my feet about anything. I know what I want. I want Clint. That's good to hear. Oh. So what did I miss? <sighs> I used to like enforcement law. I still do. What I don't like is bureaucrats who rewrite the law to suit themselves. Hey, what? No, John, John, don't let the system get in the way of you doing what you're supposed to do. Yeah, what am I supposed to do? Once a cop, always a cop. What, you're quoting my old man back to me now? You're lucky, John. You know, you have a gift, a legacy. Don't just throw all that away. Yeah, this is Michael? Hey, yeah, it's Todd. The baby's here. Uh, great. Okay, yeah, um, we'll, we'll be right over there. Now, Jessica couldn't have asked for a better mother. Not like she had a choice. Hey, she knows how much you love her. You were the one who got through to her when no one else could. Yeah, I know, I know, but... Charlie, I just wish I had seen the signs, because then the baby might not have... No, 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 Vicky. What's done is done. And, yeah, after some time, Jessica will heal, but she'll get through this. I wish I could be as sure of that. Well, you can, I guarantee it. You do, do you? Yes, hey. She's got you. 
We've got Natalie and Jared. Oh, Natalie and Jared. What, they're not in trouble too, are they? No, no, no. I mean, they never even had a proper wedding. They had to carry that awful secret around well, with them Well, yeah, but they months. got married, didn't they? I mean, that's what really counts. Yeah. But she wanted a big, happy celebration, you know? Well, you know, there's nothing in the rule book says that you can't get married more than once. That's right. Maybe when this is all over, yeah, sure. things maybe settle we, down, maybe we can do that. Yeah, maybe we could, uh, we could be right there with them. Of course we will. You think my daughter's getting married a second time no, without Vicky, me? No, Vicky, Vicky, I'm... I was kind of thinking of something else. Jessica. It's hard to talk about. Okay. All right. If you change your mind, I'm right here. I'm going to tell you everything, just not right now. Okay. You know what? I am starving. How about some Chinese? What about next month? For Chinese? For our wedding. Nora, I want to set a date. Is there a reason in the world that we shouldn't get married? As soon as possible. I'm not trying to push your buttons. Come on, Bo. Quoting my dad reminded me of my legacy. No, no, you don't need reminding. What are you here for? To tell you to quit kidding yourself. This? Come on, this is not you. It is now. So what can I get you? At least promise me that you'll give it some thought. I'll give it some thought. What'll it be? Well, I just uh, wondered uh, what it would take for me to, to rent the place out. How much notice would I have to give you? For you? A day or two. Why? Uh, well, Clint's getting married. Then I might throw him a party. So your brother's marrying your ex-wife? Yeah. You got a problem with that? No. No. Are you? I felt what you're feeling, remember? <laughs> I pretended to be Shane's father and shot the guy who really is his dad. All because I couldn't face the truth. You loved him like he was your own. And deep down I knew he wasn't mine. Just like you. But you got better. Because you helped me. I didn't... I didn't do anything. Are you, are you kidding? You understood me. Just like I understand you now. I feel like I... know you better than anyone. And it's because... I've never loved anyone like I love you. Do you think she's hungry? Well, she just polished off about half of that bottle and they gave her some uh, solid food right before she came over here. But we don't have any baby food to give to Marcy. Um, Jessica gave Dad a list of things that she likes and, and doesn't like. Yeah. Um, maybe, maybe I can take a picture. Can we take a picture of all of you? Or? Uh, 